Um, again, we're playing their full court stuff, and it was the other team that sadly was having to have guys carried off with cramps and things like that. Okay. And these guys just kept going the whole game, and they never let. They they got about a ten point lead, and they never let it go the whole game because they said, "Hey, if we, it gets close, funny things can happen. We're not going to let it even get close." Okay. So, so this was the first Leyland, 1985. That's correct. The first Leyland for Hudson High School. That's right. And uh, roughly what ye, what forms were these players? Is form they were now mostly lower sixes. Lower sixes, okay. Yeah, form okay. fives. Then uh, the following year, then it, the, the competition was held at the Mutare Boys High. Okay. And it was just a no contest. Okay. Um, do you remember some of the teams you played in the... Well, I, I remember in the semi-final we played against Prince Edward. And, you know, Prince Edward had been dominating up to that point. But what we noticed um, up till then, and especially Sonny Revis, who was uh, working, uh, doing um, architectural stuff yes. and everything at the mission, he, he was working with me. The two of us were coaching together. And he was out scouting them while we were having our game. Okay. And he just came back and he said, hey, those guys, they've got some really good players, but they only want to get the ball inside. They don't, they don't have anybody shooting from outside. So we just closed the middle completely. And they were finished. You know? <laughs> we, won it. we won it. The second half, we had our first five rest. And the second five just played the whole second half. Okay. And we won it by about 30 points or something. Wow. wow. So then we get to the final. And the that was now against Morgan. And Morgan was the hotshot team of, you know, the, that generation. And I bet it was payback time for the previous point yeah, shave and yeah. scandal. <laughs> so these kids now... <coughs> These kids went out there, and we let. And the first team was out. And they, oh, they begged me, please, please, before the game. A lot of us are upper sixes. We want to be able to have one last great game. D don't put the second five in quickly. <laughs> <laughs> yes, we'll be ahead, but let us play more. So we did let them play more. The second five definitely had their playing time, but the first five got a lot of playing time in there. And they won that game, I remember, 99 to 50. Wow. And this was the f national final. Wow. Uh, they were just a very, very good team. Wow. Very, very good team. So, so around that same time, 85, what level were the girls' teams competing at? Um... Our girls were also very good. There was um, Domatila, Musawazi, Rosemary, um, Mutambara and some of those guys that were there at that time. And they were very solid, very good. Um, we, we should have won, okay, I'm on camera so I won't say it, but we had a, we had a very unfortunate um, series of calls that were made by the coach of the other team who also happened to be the referee, one of the referees in the game. And we were ahead by a point with seconds to go. They had called a timeout, which was illegal because it was a running clock. The clock was stopped. The ball was then brought to the sideline. We were then, the two teams were meeting, fine. And then he now came and took the ball and handed it to the opposing team, who immediately went in there before our team was even on the court and scored unopposed. Oh. And that was the end of the game. Okay. 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 <laughs> so again, tough going. Eh? Tough okay. going. But um, that team then went on and won the national championship. Okay. The other guys. Okay. So, I mean, we were good enough definitely to be right there. So it, it was a good side. Okay, so with these stars at the, uh, uh, like the Josiah Kudewas, how was their provincial team when they went to provincial tournaments? Oh, our provincial team in those days was just totally dominant. It was for many years. Um, 
the you know it started with those guys then as time went on you had some big youngsters from Abudzi High School you had big kids from Mutari Boys High from Marist and everything and we just year after year after year totally dominated the national competitions. Okay, okay. Um, it was good fun. All right, good, yeah. good. So then the next block of years, 1986 to 1990, who were your players you remember in that block? You know, 86 to 90 and memorable stories. Yeah, I'm trying to remember now the, the key people in those years. Um, I know that we, that. I think that was the years of um, Roger Muzawazi, of Tendai Matsenyengwa, uh, Tendai was national team, um, he was a